Okay, we're at Walnut Canyon. We're almost done with the loop and start our ascent out of the canyon. But I just wanted to show one more time some of these cliff dwellings. And those are pretty far on the other side of the canyon. But it's amazing to walk through here and to see how these people lived. And what really brings it home for me is the size of the entryways into their homes. Very small, very small, like maybe three feet tall, less than two feet wide, these doors. And maybe it was just efficient that way or convenient. But if, if someone is four to five feet tall or even pushing six feet tall, then, you know, stooping down to go out of a door like that all the time would be very inconvenient. The part that we're not seeing is how they secured the door at night. Why would they have such a small doorway? What function did that serve? To me, it's easier to secure and easier to guard. But the question is, what were they... What were they hiding from? In my opinion, the only reason you would live like this and not out on the plateaus is because you needed the security. But the question is, is from what? What was it that these people were hiding from? I've yet to hear anybody give a good answer. I don't think it would have been their neighbors, but it could have been. Could have been other tribes, sure. But, man, if my survival just depended on me finding food and water every day, coming down into one of these canyons to make war with another tribe would be the least of my concerns. So what was it that had people living like this? To go through all the trouble of living like this something to think about.